Well, we got him, right? I uh, flushed that mean old conduit for you. Good job, everybody. Especially you, guys. Bioterrorist. Henry Daughtry. I was a bioterrorist. Conduit. He's a word used by traitors who sympathize with their cause. You're not a traitor. Are you? I, uh... I, I try not to be. <laughs> <laughs> you seem nervous. No, I'm not nervous. <laughs> It's been my experience, there are only two reasons for people to be nervous. Either they're cowards, or they have something to hide. Well, you know, I also get nervous around pretty girls. You were in there with that bioterrorist for some time. Did he share anything with you? Um, share... Did he say anything to you? share any of his ramblings about conspiracies? Um, um, no, he didn't, he didn't share anything. Good. That's good to hear. You see, we are engaged in a life and death war with these bioterrorists, and it's my job to do whatever it takes. To ensure that we win that war. What? Well, that's kind of funny because <laughs> aren't you a bioterrorist too? Okay, okay, okay. Yes, I am. Sometimes you have to fight fire with fire. And it's clear now that you're not a coward, which means there's something that you're not telling me. Oh, what, are you, what are you doing? You can't do this, you crazy! I've got rights! And I have the legal authority to suspend those rights whenever I feel it's necessary. Like now, for instance, I'll ask again what happened in there. And I will tell you again. Ah! <sighs> <sighs> I'm told that hurts. Maybe I know what happened to no, there. No, Betty, don't. No. Really? Still nothing. Well, unless you decide that you do have something to tell me, I'll go chat with that nice old lady. But you should know, concrete is especially hard on brittle bones. And if she doesn't talk, I'll just move on to the next one, and the next, until I find someone who does. So do you have something you want to tell me? Or do you prefer that I move on to your friends here?
Piss off. Then I have no further use for you. <laughs> Hope you're not as stubborn as that one. Are you, Betty? Yeah, I'm told that hurts. into a hospital? anyone do this? How many people did she hurt? And no one could stop her? Oh my god. Betty. Augustine wasn't bluffing, huh? Well, no one here was gonna turn you in to protect themselves. We're Comish. We take care of our own. I guess I did the right thing. You imagine what that bitch would have done to me if I'd actually talked? Probably the same thing she did to everyone else in this room when you didn't. Do me a favor and um, tell everybody else that uh, I said uh, thanks for taking one for the team. you there. A little concrete in the legs? It's a thing more than that. Oh. Glad to see fast healing seems to be a part of your new, uh, thing. Uh, speaking of which, um, the craziness with the hands, is that gone? Yeah, I don't know, man. There's no smoking in the longhouse, remember? All right. And I wouldn't want to get in the way of anyone's recovery. Recovery? Hey, Delson, these, these people aren't getting any better. You're dying, man. You don't know that. No, but the doctors who came through here when you were out, they do. 
And they said that... They said the only way those shards are coming out is the exact same way they went in. What? Yeah. But that... that was Augustine and her concrete power. Yeah. And screw it, man. Looks like you and me are going to Seattle and we're gonna go get her. Whoa, 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 wait. What? You think you're just gonna charm her into coming back here with you? Come on, man. I know you took a bump to the head, but you two didn't exactly hit it off last time you were together. Reggie, I did this, and I gotta fix it. No, damn it, Dustin, you just got back on your feet. Look, I know you want to help, but the doctors have already said the only- The only way it's getting out is with the same power, I get it. Which means, you don't actually need Augustine. We just need her power. <laughs> okay, now you've lost me. I'm a goddamn power sponge, remember? If I got smoke, why can't I get concrete? <laughs> yeah, but what, what if smoke was just a fluke, huh? I mean, think about it, you'd have to go through, a, what, a thousand DUP guys just to get to her? Yeah, probably something like that. I'll explain in the truck. What truck? I don't have a truck, I... That's oh, my truck. All right, I got this whole thing figured out, okay? We, we hit the town, we load up at the all-you-can-leech condo at Power Buffet, we maybe swing by the Space Needle, always wanted to see it, and then we're back home to save some lives. You do realize when we hit the town, there's a fair chance the town's gonna, you know, hit back? What does that even mean? It means that Seattle has half a million people that aren't exactly thrilled about the bioterrorists that are already there. You think they're gonna welcome you? Wake up, man. Look, don't worry, Dell. all right? We're gonna fix this thing. I'm gonna find you a cure. A cure? But shooting smoke out of your fingertips isn't exactly normal, man. Just because it's not normal doesn't mean that it needs a cure, okay? Van Gogh wasn't normal. Gandhi wasn't normal. Yeah, but people weren't scared of Gandhi, all right? People are afraid of bioterrorists. They're freaks. See, that's pre-programmed bull... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit. Great. Huh. Well... Looks like we're walking the rest of the way. <laughs> Walk? What? Yeah. Where are you going? Hey! Crap, would you look at this? Look, you know, if you're having second thoughts, I completely- Are you kidding me? This is amazing! This is destruction. This is self-defense, man. The roadblock was set up to attack them. Yeah, because they're bioterrorists. Well, it didn't stop them, and it's not gonna stop this bad boy either. Man, this is like a post of oh, This must be the mothership. Jesus, Delson! Hey, are you okay? Okay? I'm better than okay, man. I think I picked up a new trick. Yep. <laughs> oh, God. yeah. Definitely new and improved. Delson, this is not improved, man. We're trying to fix the problems you already have, not... Add new ones. What do you think? Augustine is just sitting on her ass? I gotta power up if I'm gonna go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Concrete Queen. Hey, I'm hoping to avoid that. Listen, there might be another way that we can get to Augustine. What other way? I, what other I way? I have a few connections in Seattle, right? Some in the police force. No, 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 no. This is not the point where Reggie swoops in and makes everything all right. That's this is not your problem to fix. It is mine. Oh, is somebody there? Can you hear me? There. Perfect. You want to go help somebody? Go save damsel in distress. Anyone? It's not... Please? Right. Fine. We both go. Come oh, on. no, 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 no. You I go need... play super cop, okay? I will catch up with you in a minute. 
All right, but don't go anywhere. And for God's sake, don't touch anything! I'm gonna touch everything. Hello. You're up first, little guy. Okay, yeah, that could definitely be habit forming. Yeah, they're kind of cute. Now it's time to kill them. Good to go. Should do the trick. Ooh, man, once we hit the city, I'm gonna have to keep an eye out for more of those things. Time to get me some more of that tangle. Hey, Delson, I need you up here. Dude, you will not believe what that beeping was. Let's get I... up here, okay? I found a bus full of relief workers that's stuck. I'm trying to convince them to just abandon the bus. I don't want to leave all the medical supplies on top. Well, just tell them to hold on. I'll get the bus unstuck. Delson, I know what you're thinking, and don't. Dude, I just took out a fleet of quadcopters. I think I can dig out a bus. I'm trying to convince them to just abandon the bus. They don't want to leave all the medical supplies on top. Well, just tell them to hold on. I'll get the bus unstuck. Nelson, I know what you're thinking, and don't. Dude, I just took out a fleet of quadcopters. I think I can dig out a bus. This is gonna take forever. There's gotta be a faster way. I am unstoppable! I'm sorry, Reg. Can't hear you over the sound of my heroics. Delson, I'm not... Ah, lost you. Must have hit the mute button. Okay, looks like the rest of the way is clear. Time to ride this baby straight into Seattle. Delson, we got a problem. Some of the people on the bus, they saw you doing your super thingy to clear the way. And? And they're afraid of you. What? Look, I told you, man. Bioterrorists aren't especially popular. This is what am I, like, Rosa Parks, and they want me to sit on the back of the bus? No, they want you to sit outside the bus. Look, they don't want you in here, right? They said if you come on, they're gonna get off. Then let them walk. I don't care. You think I can't take this door down? You are not gonna do that. These people have never seen anything like you before, and they're scared, right? And I can't blame them. He says he's gonna break down the door. Go, sir. 
Just give me a second. Look, just let me run them across the bridge. I'll come right back for you, all right? It'll take five minutes. Come on, man. I can't let you on the bus. Five minutes. on the GPS tracking on your phone, in case we get separated? Oh, you mean like, right now? Attention, the scheduled decommission of the 520 bridge by order of the DUP will begin shortly. All vehicles and individuals are ordered to... Huh. Sounds like useful information. Nelson, I got the aid workers across the DUP. Clearing the bridge. Coming back for you, so... Is you there? What's going on? Hello? Hey! Hey! You guys need any help? Oh, shit. A bioterrorist! Hey! It's one of those it's freaks! It's okay. Whoa! No, 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 no! Oh. <laughs> oh, this fast healing stuff is gonna come in real handy. Shoot me like that? Big mistake. It's mine now. Okay, okay, I'll give up, okay? Just don't hurt me! See? We're not all monsters. Spread the word. Oh, this is gonna suck. <laughs> what the hell just happened? <laughs> Reggie? Oh man, answer me! Oh. My. God. This was a bridge? Thank you. 
I'm coming, Reg. Come on, core relay, work your magic. Another shot. Okay, Cosmos, keep them coming. <laughs> okay, okay, easy. Bad time, Betty. You took off before I was through talking to you. Well, you know, I had, I had plans. I heard you and Reggie were heading to Seattle, of all places. <laughs> really gotta go, Betty. Love you. Almost across. And there, Delta. Almost across. Almost across. Yes, cut it out, Devil Bridge. Pitching are we, huh? Delson! All right, all right, all right, come on. I got it. Thanks for the hand. Huh? Take it out. Wow. You seem to be getting the hang of your uh, new symptoms, right? <laughs> of course, the only downside being that. Uh... Nope. Can't think of anything. This is pretty freaking awesome. <laughs> really? No downside? How about those heavily armed guys over there now want to hurt you real bad? That a downside? Yeah. Now look, for all we know, we may be able to pass you through their security, you know, because you're not a normal bio terrorist. So... Normal? No, no, if you mean by normal, you know, the sheep that they try to line up so that they can probe them. No, Reggie, I'm not normal. And did you see what I did on that bridge? We can did. take these Look, guys. Let's just see if we can sneak you through their checkpoints first, all right? It'll make getting around the city a lot easier. 
Okay, fine, fine. Do it your way. I'll settle. Listen, promise me you'll play it cool up ahead. Hey, they used to call me Mr. Cool. No one has ever once called you that. Ever. 